welcome to today's video. It is gloriously cold outside and we're expected to have a cold weekend. Which means we should put our blankets on. Is that my blanket? Yeah. Ugh. What a mess. But who doesn't like to see a little bowl of carrots? <laughs> All right, Gabby's doing grain. Gracie's waiting for grain. We're in a hurry today. Comment below if you have to clean your horse before you can put it outside each day. Or put a blanket on or whatever else. My girl always be looking like this. Always. <laughs> Inside, outside, you name it, wherever she is, she always be looking like this. Yesterday, if you guys saw yesterday's video, Penny escaped the stall and it was the cutest thing. I think I left her stall open like this. What are you doing? I'm being tall. <laughs> She's being tall. So I left the stall open just like a tiny bit. I do it all the time with her while I'm waiting for her to eat because she's like such a serious girl. She would never misbehave. Like, isn't that amazing? Anyways, so then I forgot and I was in the arena and suddenly we heard her trying to open the stall and I was like sneaking to watch what she would do. And she opened the door and she just stood there and she was looking and she was snorting. She was snorting at the ground. Even though she knows the ground, she was snorting because she was like, this is weird. What do I do? There's nobody here to stop me. So then I tried to change position so I could video better. I didn't want her to see me, but she saw me. And as soon as she saw me, she's like, I guess I can go. And then she went. But then when she got to me, she was like looking around like, did I do the right thing? Like, what's happening here? She's so smart. Okay. And then we all got Okay. So we left all the stalls. Uh oh. <laughs> Open. Run. Run, Gabby. Run. Willow. <laughs> Willow's like, I can't do it. <laughs> hey, run! All right, we left the stall doors open just a tiny bit. <laughs> Gracie's looking at us. She's like, what should we do? Oh my god, we should be able to get through that. Mine fall or something. All right, let's let's do it. Oh, Sophie, go throw hay. All right, let's go. We are in a hurry today. We're headed to the other barn. Everybody's ready. All right, bye Penny Pickle. Have a good day, princess. Whoa. <laughs> Dare you stand in my way? I will bite you. <laughs> Penny is not like a super friendly horse. Her Open old it. owner Open told it. me, it. told me, like you'll see what she's like with the other horses. No! She's kind of standoffish. No! I don't know what that meant. And it meant like stay out of my way or I will. Be mad at you. Sophie didn't throw hay yet. Uh oh. <laughs> it's about to get wild. <laughs> oh man. You go, there. you go there. Oh. We love you, Gracie. We love you. It's supposed to be a really crappy weekend, and Sophie and I want to set the arena up like we did before with like uh, obstacle course and stuff for the mares. That was really fun for us. We want to do it again. So hopefully we get an opportunity to do that this weekend. When you bring three horses into the barn at the same time. Okay, oh, hold on, hold on. What the heck are you doing, dude? Okay, hold on. <laughs> Don't know what I'm doing here. All right, so we are here. And Gabby's gotten so good at walking two horses, and our horses are actually good friends. Like, Graven and Chino love each other. Sometimes when we come to the barn, we just bring them out, work with them, like clean them. Like, look at Finn. Graven, did you? Graven was laying down. This is the side. This is the side he was laying down. So we're gonna let them have a little roll, and a little run. And then we're gonna groom them. Was he laying down on the other side? Oh, that's crazy. Not the dirty side. Here, you do this blanket. I'll hold this horse. Hi, Griffin. Oh my goodness. Yes, we know, you all want to roll. <laughs> they just want to roll. I totally, come on. Come on. Whoa. Hi, big guy. This is the side you were laying on. I see the whole point about having a gray now. It's 
funny to me like how like so now that we've gotten to know Gray Finn like a lot better and know his personality like he's Calm down so much. He's so much calmer than when we first met him because he settled into the barn probably. All right, are we ready? All right, halter's off. Three, two, Jesus, the cats. Oh my God, what the heck, man? Who was that, you or the cat? Give me the, give me the one <laughs> that spooks. But anyway. This cat is so fat. <laughs> this cat is so fat. That is rude. He identifies as skinny, Gabby. I'm gonna pick it. Oh my gosh. Gabby. Sophie. I said I was gonna pick it. What are you yelling me for? Oh my God. <laughs> We're gonna give them a really good brush. Tina, don't roll right beside the pole, please. Oh, not right beside the pole. All right, that was a stupid idea. All right, right beside the pole then. Oh my God, look at that. He my wasn't even wet, wet, so it shouldn't even be sticking to him, but he went in the wet sand. Tina rolled in the dry. Look how clean my pony is. Yeah, look how clean this boy is. He doesn't is. have any mud on his belly. He has a little bit of dirt on his leg. Don't roll again. Chino's gonna get up. Yeah, so we all know that Chino's the one. I'm gonna stand in this little doorway here. Uh oh, here he goes. He's gonna run. He's gonna run. Wow, look at that big boy. Yeah, he's calm. <laughs> no shenanigans on a Friday. Thin. So, uh, for any of you guys, have, aww. Any of you guys have been worried about uh, Goldfin, our trainer rides him in training rides all the time, keeps him in shape. Well, he's still got a belly, but keeps him going, keeps him moving. Wow, oh, gray horses are not worth it. Totally not worth it. Look, he's dapple, <laughs> gray and dirt. See, I feel like I would do okay with a gray horse because I like cleaning them. Finny wants to chase Sophie. Hi, big guy. Aw, hello. Your right leg is not having it today? That's interesting. <laughs> what do you do when your right leg doesn't have it? Yeah. Okay, look how many Gabby's two horses are. And look how many my horses. <laughs> Hi, boys. These two are actually really close friends. I feel like you're going to be brushing that one. Yeah, I think I'm going to be brushing them all. Yeah, no, not mine. I'll brush the gray. Okay. All right. He was going to run, but then he was like, I. Oh my gosh. He wants to be the flower boy. Watch out, Gabby. Let me get it a picture. She know I should. No, <laughs> Don't scream! They're literally pulling the flowers out of the flower box. <laughs> Kathy's like, "Don't do it." What? <laughs> oh, that was funny because every time she go rescue flowers. <sighs> <laughs> no flowers for any of you. <laughs> they are fake, Finn. Hey, Finn. Oh, you're so handsome. Now he's dirty. Hi, Grayson. Well, yeah. he's still the cleanest. <laughs> yeah, he's, I love a good clean pony. He's the dirtiest. He knows the second dirtiest and Finn's the cleanest. All right, let's clean these babies up. They're like, I'm done. Let's get cleaned up. Let's do your feet. So, like I said in a previous vlog, um, we have been being proactive this year and, and treating our horses' feet for bacteria this year. Finn! Because of the mud. <laughs> Don't, Gabby. Finn listens. Sophie, Sophie said Finn, and he stopped trying to eat the flowers. All right. Bring, we need to take the flowers out of here. All right, everybody catch their horse. All right, Sophie's going to brush Finny in here. You got to clean it all up. Thumper meat chino. Aww, you like kitties. 
I can't believe this barn has come so far in the last week. Like when it flooded, if you haven't seen our videos recently, this barn flooded. It never ever floods like that. Not ever. Like the first year that ever flooded like that to the point where they had to shut everything down. They did so much work. It's okay. They did so much work, you guys. It was literally like they had hoses. They had people chopping ice. They had brooms uh, shoveling it all out. And it created this big lake outside and still the water just kept coming. Uh, they had people digging ditches. And every time they would like get all the water out, there would be like another thaw and it would just come running back through. And suddenly it's gone as fast as it came. Thank God. <laughs> minute after a half an hour of scrubbing and scrubbing and scrubbing and you realize like you're not gonna get it done you're not gonna get the job done don't poop in here don't poop don't poop <laughs> why like literally I get it now I get it now because the wet stuff just still is dirty I've scrubbed like all the hard stuff all the crispy stuff off and then Gabby's gonna go over him. I'm gonna just use a, a hard brush now and see if I can get more of it off. But gray horses are a lost cause. How's it going in here? My arm hurts. <laughs> My arm hurts too. But you look cute. Bay is where it's at. This side is cleaner. The other side's cleaner? This side is cleaner. Girl number two working on him. In the camera, he looks way dirtier. In the like barn, he doesn't look as bad. Oh, We're not doing a horse's cleanest competition because I'm going to lose. Like, no matter how much you brush, you can never get all the hair off. Alright, we already know. Gold thin is the cleanest. This is why we can't have white things. Darling, you guys know that TikTok? Yep. This is why we can't have white things. He's like so embarrassed. So we are going to change the blankets. Okay. They're going back. I'm going to finish cleaning the stalls. Gabby's going to die. Follow Gray Finn. Yeah, Chino will go with anybody. I keep telling myself I love spring. I'll be glad when summer's here. That is it, you guys. We are headed home. We've been here all morning. And do just doing because... routine maintenance on our boys. Cleaning, brushing. <laughs> Is Clean. this a new jug of water? Cleaning their feet. That is not a new jug of water. It's what I use to mix stuff with that I need at the barn. But the one was like this full. I know. I've been using it. I've been using it. We got this because my father in likes to buy random things. And I said, oh, we should get that. I got it. I got it out of the box. Yeah, she did. So he has glitter all over And um, I accidentally left my dog out of the cage this whole time. Okay. Oh my god, I think I just assembled it. Oh my god. Because we have paper in our slushies. So, I don't know if the girl showed you this, but this arrived in the mail today, and I feel confident that this was ordered by Sam. In the past, we've always kenneled our eggs in the basement. You guys have seen on the vlogs. Yeah, I'm gonna... Because it's dark, but we bought... One in the normal thing. But we bought this really cool incubator, and it has an egg candler on it, and so we try to use that, but you have to be in the dark. So what the heck? What the heck with the bad design? So, we are gonna try and candle some eggs. All right, so... You can't really see much. Wow, I don't know why it's, I guess it's got those lines because it's dark. But I think this one's good. I don't know if you guys can see, but you can see that dark shaded area. I don't see any veining yet. So here is a baby egg. And I see some stuff in there. I can't show it on the camera. I can't see it on the camera. I don't know if you guys can see. 
but it looks like you can see like a big thing forming right here. I don't see any veining though. Oh, it looks like I can see something even more. Oh, I think I see some veining right in here. That one's cool. And if I didn't say see it myself, I would say that what's ever in there is moving. That big huge yolk sack there looks like it's moving. All right, it is definitely moving. I flipped it upside down and that thing is moving. Do you guys see it? I don't know if you can see it, but it's moving. But I mean, maybe it's the yolk. I don't know. I think, oh, I think I see that one's. Sylvia and I are making lunch and we're gonna eat some of our gorgeous eggs. These are some of the eggs that we have had our chickens lay. We asked them, could you please lay some pretty eggs? And they lay pretty eggs. Like, they are pretty. So suddenly, this happened yesterday. We were shocked. Very Somebody shocked. laid twins and they're tiny. Let's show them compared to the other eggs. <laughs> they're so small. Like they're, wait. You need to spread this around a little bit. Yeah, so here is a regular egg. Here's a regular egg and here's the baby egg. Somebody laid two baby eggs. So we're gonna crack them and see what happens. It almost makes you feel bad to crack a baby egg though because it makes you think it's a baby. <laughs> so if you can't crack it. it looks healthy though I can't crack this it this is how a professional cracks an egg with one hand oh yeah it's really tough uh oh you can't crack these suckers oh, oh there it is it looks pretty normal cute oh goodness oh goodness my girl waiting for me you guys She's the cutest. You're both cute. All right, we are packing up for a trip tomorrow. Did you guys know that this part of my new lead rope is meant to act as a flag? I didn't know that. That's so super cool. I love it. Don't you know?